Hey guys, welcome to another Rich Alfred's live stream. I'm here as always with your favorite Luigi, Chris. Well, I don't know about my favorite Luigi, but uh, <laughs> it's, it's the one I've always worked with. <laughs> Friendship with Mario. Now Wario is my best friend. <laughs> uh, so we're about to do a special uh, live stream commentary ridicule, you know, just riff tracks on our, our uh, stupid Mario Brothers Summer Special. Now, what is the stupid Mario Brothers Summer Special, you might be asking yourself? Well, I'm so glad you asked that just now. Uh, so the Summer Special was... Actually, Chris, did you want to explain this? I'm kind of just railroading sure, sure. everything. Yeah, I'll, I'll give the, uh, the quick overview. So back when Stupid Mario Bros. ended in 2012, there was about a year or two where we were making a bunch of random sketch videos. Uh, some of these were for Nintendo contests. Some of these were part of TSVGS, which was that stupid video game show. But basically, it was a bunch of random sketches of the Mario Bros that were loosely connected to Stupid Mario Bros, but they weren't technically canon. So then, fast forward a few years, uh, during, uh, in fact, Rich, you can pick up here. So what happened a few years later? So yeah, during the, between the summer of 2016 and the winter of 2017, we were working on Stupid Mario Legacy, which is of course the movie that ties together uh, Stupid Mario Brothers, Stupid Mario World, and The Plumber Knight. Uh, it kind of gives a, an ending to all three shows and, and uh, combine, like, you know, it, it, it's, it's the Isar Avengers Endgame years before Avengers Endgame. Uh, <laughs> and, uh, and so anyways, that took over a year to make. So I thought that, uh, I needed to do something in the meantime to keep everybody still interested in stupid Mario. So I compiled this, uh, summer special in the summer of 2017, uh, as a way to, and, and, and yeah, it is mostly old, old material because, uh, you know, like, as Chris said, we did a bunch of rando sketches here and there, but people were like, uh, you know, people would always ask us like, is this connected to stupid Mario brothers? Uh, and I, you know, I'd be like, well, this one is, this one kind of isn't and so on. So what I did was like, I combined them in this like Looney Tunes style compilation where myself as Mario kind of narrates in between every sketch and kind of creates a loose narrative. And then through that, it does become canon to stupid Mario brothers because now Mario is kind of telling the story of how all these things actually did happen. And I think maybe, I don't even remember. I thought maybe I made a joke in there. I'm like, Oh, actually that one didn't happen or something, but like, <laughs> but, uh, but like, yeah, so this people were asking if the summer special is canon and as the summer special it's canon to stupid Mario Brothers, but as individual sketches, they might not be because uh, I've re-edited some of them in this summer special to kind of go more in canon with stupid Mario Brothers. So just keep in mind that these sketches are only canon in this special. Uh, I don't know if there's anything else I need to say. I think we should just get started. It's that was pretty a good. <laughs> perfect intro. I love how you phrased it. It's like, it's partially canon. It's canon because I made it canon, but if there's anything that doesn't make sense, it's not canon. So you can deal <laughs> with the canon. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. Um, so quick shout out to our members. I wanted to thank AK, Marty Man, as well as Killjoy for jumping into the chat today. Uh, if you guys want to become members, it's a monthly subscription. It helps the, support the channel. You get your name with a fancy little icon. Um, wow. And it looks like uh, Marty Man actually just sent a super chat in. So before I read that, I'll say it. If throughout any point during our stream today, if you have a question or comment that you would like us to read, you can send in a super chat. Um, and then Marty Man said, how many of your videos are school film projects? Uh, a lot of them I'd before say Stupid Mario, a lot of the, but... <laughs> a lot of the early ones, yeah. Uh, there, was, there was, I'd say they started as school projects. As far as how many of them go, the only, well, the one I was involved in was the King Arthur stuff. But I know before I met Rich, he did plenty of uh, videos. But I think the King Arthur one is the, the most, uh, you know, iconic of the, uh, the school projects. All right. Well, anyway. anyways, let's get started on this uh, summer special, shall we? Let's roll. All right. I'm actually really excited because I haven't watched this in like years. So I've and some of these sketches I haven't seen in years and years and years. Oh, the good old classic Plumber Night intro. Yeah, this is just carryover from the Plumber Night intro. That's right. <laughs> so I forgot that we started it with this goofy so we had a few like ri yeah there we go <laughs> <laughs> and yes for those of you wondering that is a uh, a family guy reference right there <laughs> the super summer <gasps> my pokemon 
and sunglasses. Oh, hello, Super Mario nice. here. You may remember me from such games as Super Mario Brothers. <laughs> well, anyways, I'm kind of on the run for my arch nemesis Rathnar at the moment, but uh, I won't bore you with the details. And sorry, guys, if you hear typing in the background, that's not me or Richie. It's Richie's roommates and his extremely sensitive microphone. So I wanted to call that out in case you guys are like, Chris, why are you typing in the background? It's not me. It's not me. I, I also I wanted to point out that, like, see, like, even in, at the very beginning, I say, like, I'm hiding out from my arch nemesis Rathnar. Rathnar to to kind of like just solidify the fact that this is supposed to be kind of like in the interim between uh, the last season of Mario World and Stupid Mario Legacy. You know, see see what I did there, guys. Yeah. It's a very brilliant weaving of the narratives. Also, I look fat in this shot. Jeez. About one particular summer, a summer of excitement, of adventure, and of brotherly love. One that started with a very hairy situation. <laughs> It's like, yes, all these things just I happened, even though this was filmed several years ago. <laughs> they were like, I'm starving. What did you get? Oh, I got something better than food. What? You didn't get groceries. Nope. But Mario, that was the last of our money. Luigi, how can you be upset when you see our new Wii You <laughs> could be very Wii upset you. now. <laughs> Mario, how would you be I know, right? <laughs> Yeah, we won't have lives after we play it. Not because it's bad, but because we'll have starved to death. <laughs> Maybe it was a little bad. You think you're being just a little bit ridiculous. <sighs> a curse on you, Mario. Whatever <laughs> happens to Mario in the video game happens to you. What was that? <laughs> Nothing. Well, now that we're broke, we're gonna need a roommate to help pay for groceries and rent. What? A roommate? I don't want anyone else living here. Well, too bad, Mario. This is your fault. Ah, what a drag. Well, guess I'll make a sign. <laughs> oh, this is so good. <sighs> the funny thing is we actually filmed this, of well, course, after looks like the... like no one wants a room with us. I'll go take the After sign. the Nintendo uh, special. Yeah, but it's like I just had that whole thing about the Wii U so that, that it gave some... You were saying? Some... <laughs> context to that video. Context. <laughs> and we had all these references to Donkey Kong being a terrible roommate back to early SMB, so that finally happening was just full circle. He just trots in like he owns the place. Absolutely not! Anyone but him! Beggars can't be Choosers, is there Mario, is there DK. is there not a shot of the three of us together because we had to keep rotating the suit? <laughs> oh gosh, probably. <laughs> because I noticed that you're not on the couch when DK sits down, and then there's that one shot of of, of uh, DK and Luigi, and DK suddenly a little shorter, and you don't see me in that shot. So I think we had to keep rotating the the DK oh, geez. suit. Is your that no sounds about right. So you better get used to the idea. <laughs> oh, 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 no. <laughs> One day later. One day later. <sighs> My yellow fans look like they could uh, use some love there. <laughs> I'm not leaving this spot. What's wrong? If you saw the things I've seen, you wouldn't move either. Really? Oh, jeez. <laughs> like what? <laughs> I'm Speakable things. Bananas flying around like body parts. Bongos as loud as bombs. Did I turn into Nathan Lane? Tell me, Luigi. It's just gonna go away for dramatic emphasis. Be in the kitchen sink. Donkey Kong peeing in the sink. That's uh, way back to like, uh, smells like Bowser. <laughs> you stay away from me! Mario, come on, this is ridiculous! I'm... I'm sorry, Luigi, I can't stay here anymore! What? That's crazy! Just stay another hour, we'll work it out. An hour? That's too long! That's right. not that much time at all! <laughs> Have you ever stared at a clock for an hour? Oh, that would take a really long time! It would take one hour! <laughs> I forgot about that joke. <laughs> <laughs> the 
think we had made that joke a whole bunch and we finally fit it into uh, a Video, sketch. Yeah. It would take one hour. <laughs> Wanna eat more bananas? Yeah. <laughs> and I did sit by a tree, and I enjoyed my peace and quiet. So long, in fact, that my mustache grew back. <laughs> but <laughs> you have to, like, explain the changing facial <laughs> The continuity errors. <laughs> what happened to me? This video right here is my favorite out of every single non-SMB sketch we ever did. Well, I guess it is SMB. But this was for the Nintendo uh, contest in 2012. We were part of a, a promotional contest for the Wii U. And I absolutely love how this video turned out because we spent a ton of time on it. I love the Miyamoto and Reggie Phil's uh, pictures on the wall. <laughs> we photoshopped a signature onto the Miyamoto picture so it wasn't a real signature. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but just so you guys were wondering oh and this is before we had a capture card so we had to just film the tv oh, oh my head <laughs> it's a, it's such a clever idea of mario being controlled uh I, I i just it's it's so charming and so simple and uh, i just this is one of those videos i would come back to quite a few times <laughs> Of course, we did the uh, the Yoshi betrayal. <laughs> I, I I never noticed it before, but right there, where uh, I noticed this the last time I watched it, but right there, right before we cut to Mario being sad, you can hear your cousin going, huh. "Oh, jeez, that's right." Because my cousin Dominic helped uh, help film this at the time. Good times. He's like, huh. <laughs> Oh, it's it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Uh, and I don't. It's so quick and so subtle, and it's not very loud that you like. I just throughout the two times that I've edited this, I've never heard it, and I only noticed it last time I watched it. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Miyamoto. There he is. DK pause the game. <laughs> and this is one of those times where we wore mustaches since the audience was going to be non Rich Alvarez fans. <laughs> I also love the idea that you come out as Luigi with a Luigi uh, plushie, so I like the idea that Luigi sleeps with a stuffed animal <laughs> of himself. <laughs> well, I mean, it, it, we're, we're just meta meta this whole thing because like, Donkey Kong is playing you in a video game and I'm holding a doll of myself. You, Luigi is his own best friend. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a trying to sleep. <laughs> also, have you seen? <laughs> you can always tell when we're doing like what we're we're trying to be like more professional or whatever because we put the mustaches on. We have like this depth of field going on, and you know that we we try to do a little bit better Italian accents. <laughs> then we then we get back to our own projects and we just drop everything. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Mario. <laughs> whatever. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> it's like we're subtly showing off that you can play the game on the gamepad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that was one of the contest rules or something. Hmm. <laughs> I forgot we made the raccoon costume or squirrel or whatever that is. <laughs> <laughs> EDMG generously just super chatted us and said, Rich is asleep with a punch of himself? <laughs> <laughs> no. I, I love that sh that shot like from below where it looks like I'm flying is so good. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good shot. I just love how the it, the music switches back and forth between being all epic and then happy and silly. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> 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 well, I guess Mario's dead. <laughs> Hmm. <laughs> no. This was on a different day because we had to have uh, 
Oh, geez. I bet Nick and Chris from Mercedes Avenue are probably in those costumes. So it's funny my because guess. Um, uh, originally, in the original video, it was this was where like the advertisement happened. So it was like, new Super Mario Brothers U available now on the... But like, of course, for the Super Summer, it's just a montage. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then we played the Wii U for so long that we broke it. I was determined to get another one, but I hadn't right. left the house in so long that my beard and my hair were extra long and extra super gross. I love how you gotta explain the, uh, oh, hey, Matt's in this. I forgot about that. Oh, yeah. You poorly. So you had to explain it because I, I looked at this and thought I looked gross and so I had to include that little <laughs> bit. But I also love Matt playing again his Italian gangster. <laughs> yeah, he does such a great job on that. Are you sure? Because I was told an Italian guy with a sure? beard named Paulie was going to meet me at the same time. What for? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm supposed to deliver the Wii U he ordered from a uh, Sorry, I just have to point it. This calls back to the styrofoam video of, uh, of uh -huh. you know, like, hey, you want some uh, cup noodle? You know? Like, I forgot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, on the ground now. <laughs> <laughs> legitimate organization. Yeah. <laughs> the Mothers and Fathers Italian Association. Good talk. What's that acronym stand for, boys and girls? <laughs> Mafia. Oh, and then for some reason, Matt is Wario. <laughs> Thank you, Killjoy. Killjoy just uh, generously super chatted and said, Super chatting for Pauly. <laughs> Thank you, Killjoy. That's all I have left. Well, too bad. Sorry, Maybe Mario, Mario is Polly. He told me to meet him here at this exact <laughs> time. Competition. Hand it over. Make me. I will. Go ahead then. I'm gonna take a shot. I'm warming up. Bring it on. I'm gonna bring it. It's about to be brought. It is. <laughs> gonna hit me or so what? good. <laughs> Stupid. I'm just just getting. That's classic SMV right there. I love how like your accents kind of come in and out just depending on the scene. <laughs> I'm gonna get you now, Mario. <laughs> <laughs> Got your wallet. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody was saying there's uh, great bloopers for that part. I forget where the bloopers are, but I'm sure they were hilarious. Also, I think that you were so sick of your hair, you ended up completely shaving everything. I did, yeah. <laughs> like, buzz cut. Well, I'm tired of holding this, so you better be poorly. Oh, you actually have a Wii U? Of course I do. What'd you think I was? Some guy trying to rip you off in the parking lot? Well, yeah. <laughs> you know what? That's fair. I've been on that before. <laughs> so you want the Wii U or not? You know what? Why not? I have to bring something home. Excellent. But you got to do one thing before I give it to you. What? In exchange for the Wii U, Paulie promised me he'd shave his beard. <laughs> Mother f Well, needless to say, <laughs> I had grown attached to my beard. I did shave it off, but I would grow it back someday. Hilarious. In a more organized and groomed way. But for now, it was time to return to our childhood home. Luigi and I had been renting an apartment because the house was suffering from pest problems. Oh, so we that's right. To stay at the house for a few days. I forgot so about this one. Okay. But we did find pests of the ninja variety. Oh, yeah, this is we... this football episode. You even wove that in. Yeah, I incorporated the whole foot. And even though this is like several, several years before we filmed any of that other stuff. <laughs> Just... I love how you're weaving all this in, because, yeah, this was, it came out before all the apartment vids. Uh, or maybe it was around that time, but anyway. This is going to feel a little bit more like a season four episode. This was, wow, was really <laughs> this was also just a way for me to, like, edit the football stuff into one cohesive thing. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, and Garrett's in there. That's Garrett, right? Yeah, Garrett's got the, the red <laughs> scarf on his head. <laughs> uh, I forgot about that. Oh, jeez, I forgot about Zubashi. And this video also includes, in my opinion, Garrett's greatest role <laughs> as the ref. <laughs> Stop. Okay, good for you, Zardushi. 
You know what? Uh, I'm over this crap. I don't care anymore that no one gets my freaking name right. Oh yeah, Sandusky. <laughs> Let's go inside, Wario, and leave Dombrowski and his friends to try to be athletic. <laughs> I heard that we are much better athletes than you. <laughs> wow, I didn't realize athlete had three syllables. Athlete, that's amazing. How dare you make fun of my athletic and grammar skills? I am so the blood, red ninja. I challenge you to a duel. It, this reminds me that I wrote that uh, that Zubashi prequel where it explained that he was just like a, a postal worker from like the south. <laughs> that, like he he watched Bruce Lee's Enter the Dragon and he was like, ah, I am ninja. But like, <laughs> dang, but that never that was something that just got written. It never turned into a video, did it? We never filmed it, no. And I don't oh, remember wow. why. I think I was just <laughs> over it. <laughs> wow, a little bit of a pre unwritten history here. Unwritten history. Well, it was written, just unfilmed. Well, I guess. On film history, yeah. yeah. What you gonna do? We gonna throw ninja stars at each other? No. We shall partake in a contest of great proportions. Super Smash Brothers? <laughs> no. Ninja Gaiden? No. Super Mario? No. <laughs> we shall play football. Football? football? Yes. No, I, I love me some football. This did we? As do my chum. Say what now? Matt was the one that wrote this, right? Yes, Matt. Matt wrote the the script. Of course, I I added a few jokes, but yeah, the, yeah, the yeah, whole yeah. structure and everything and ninety nine percent of the dialogue was Matt. Yeah, and we we did invite Matt on the stream. Unfortunately, he's busy today, but he'll be on the next one. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, but we need to find more teammates. Got some weird ninjas. One hour to collect your teammates and meet us at the northern field. Or you could forfeit right now. Bring it on! Just <laughs> 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 ridiculous extended <laughs> laughing. <laughs> and I got one more. <laughs> Oh, right, we gotta find some teammates. I know. Let's get cracking. Luigi! Zobashi and the ninjas! They challenged us to a football game! Are you in or out? No one gets your Aladdin references, Mario. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody gets your Aladdin references, Mario. <laughs> I love that. In 2009. I mean, that's a really deep cut because Are You In or Out is a song from Aladdin and the Forty Thieves. So I knew that that was a joke that no one was going to get. <laughs> Watch Aladdin and the Forty Thieves. Welcome to the Forty Thieves. <laughs> anyways, uh, somebody asked if Julian was one of the ninjas. He is not, unfortunately. Um, anyways, yeah. What movie? Never mind. Oh, I'm referencing the stupid Mario Bros. movie. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and Richie's looking at the camera. We only Meta. have three of us, and we don't know anything serious about football. I don't care. I'm not going to let Chumdinsky beat us. Subashi! <laughs> <laughs> we can get DK uh, and Yoshi to play. EDMG generously super chatted us and said, I got your Aladdin and reference, Nest Mario. <laughs> well done, EDMG. Well done. Okay. So oh, I forgot Ness is in here. How do we learn how to play proper <laughs> football? I got this under control. You do? Trust me. <laughs> I love this little montage. <laughs> Matt uh, gives us a hype. To be fair, Matt is actually, like, he made that uh, that graph, and he's actually giving real football tips, but I, like, turned it into a montage because I didn't think anyone would care. <laughs> Matt, Matt is was super into football and still is super into football, so for him, he knew, he knew what he was talking about. <laughs> That's right. Jeez, this is that uh, oh, that college football game that NCAA. Matt used to be super into. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it even said Alvarez and Provencal on the screen. Yeah, we, were playing <laughs> we actually already. we actually took some time to really uh, really type it out. I think those were just in there because we were playing the game previously. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that's right. We probably were. Yeah, let's do this. Think they'll show, my lord? Hmm. We shall see.
<laughs> this is reminiscent of many previous episodes of Stupid Mario Bros. Well, look who showed up! We would never back down to you. Yeah, Zubishki. You know, I really hate you guys. All the more reason why I'm going to kick your ass. Now, ground rules and limits. All right, this is not a real football field, so no extra points, no field goals, just touchdowns. Agreed. First team to score 30 points wins. Who's going to be the ref? Both of our sides would make us biased. I will. <laughs> I oh, jeez, he looks so Mario young. <laughs> Just, uh, you can see me holding the script for Garrett in his sunglasses. <laughs> <He's> wow. <laughs> uh, that's good. That's real good. Uh. Linebacker, coach, prodigy, QB guru, and awesome player. I have been retired for three whole days. I will be your referee. <laughs> Why should we trust you? Guy's talking to himself. Because You're talking to Garrett. I will kill you. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> now. Time for a coin toss. Mario Bros, heads or tails? We'll take heads. Heads. Mario Bros, will you receive or defend? Receive. Then kick off, and let's begin. All right, I have the best arm, so yeah. I'm quarterback. I don't remember the uh, I, I, like we we had we kept switching out who was Zubashi in the background when I was Mario. <laughs> I, I I'm trying to remember. It was one of Matt's friends that was uh, in the Zubashi costume in that shot when I was uh, oh okay showing everybody. But I I remember. Oh, if geez. Matt was here, he could tell us. But <laughs> all the all the back and forth on the costumes was just <laughs> it made it definitely very tricky to film. By the way, we just hit a hundred people watching. Thank you everybody for tuning Ooh, in. Awesome. Back. Um, Yoshi, you're a guard. Mario, running back. <laughs> Nest, tight end. Luigi, wide receiver. DK, center. Ready? Double F22 option on two. Ready? Wait, what? I don't know. I'm going to throw the ball, so just get open, okay? Ready? Uh, it, Adventure Ruler just said, Where have you been, Rich? I remember watching your vids when I was 13. Hello, welcome back. Uh, I'm still here. <laughs> we make videos every Saturday, like this one. Uh, this is a good time to uh, resubscribe and hit the notification bell since we know the YouTube algorithm basically disappeared our channel, but we still are alive. And we've been doing a lot of uh, live stream rewatches of our old content. So uh, yeah, be sure moon, to uh, hit the notification bell. I still put up some good content. In fact, just yesterday I posted a video, but I'll talk about it a little bit later. Otherwise, I'll, that's all I'll talk about. <laughs> It's like our strategy of rewatching old content is uh, waking up our old viewers. So thanks for coming back, guys. <laughs> Man, those ninjas were insane. Damn them! Ninjas, huddle up, huddle up. <laughs> okay, guys. For my oh, that's a great shot. Reasons, I need to beat these guys. Are you ready to help me? Yes. yes. All right. Break. <laughs> Good Tarantino. Uh, um, Matt Sturgis is the one being like, oh. hey, He was the original YouTube bum. I forgot we were doing this Naruto style quarterback ninja magic. Minus yardage for you. Quarterback sacked, minus nine yards. There's no yard markings on this field. <laughs> Just take nine big steps backwards. God. <laughs> okay, Captain Rude Pants. I like how the, the, the whistle keeps falling out of his mouth, but in every shot it's back. Oh, that sounds like the Water Wars victory song. It is the Water Wars victory song. Dang. I guess we would have still had that on file because Water Wars 2 had come out a few months earlier. What year was this? This was like 2000. This is 2012. This is 2012. I oh, remember was it was 20... right. It was right after Super Mario Bros. Season 5 ended, just a few months later. It was that summer. Yeah. This is like the first of all the videos we made. Oh, and uh, thank you very much for Ellen Wade's generous super chat. They said, thanks for the years of endless entertainment. Well, and you are welcome, and thanks for still watching. Thank you for the years of being a fan. I also really like your gorilla profile pic. That's really cool. <laughs> That's a cool picture. 
90 DR yard punt return. <laughs> Sturgis, his ninja all of a sudden became an Italian ninja. He's like, what the now? <laughs> uh. Great. Ike says this sucks. I'm aware. <laughs> Touchdown, ninjas! That's the end of the first quarter. Kick off! Green 12! Green 12! Hot. Whistle! <laughs> he just scales a whistle. Big ass first down. <laughs> what are we, the Cleveland Browns? Step up the defense. Oh, yes, my lord. Yes. Get off your ass. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Hustle, huh? yeah, that's a reference that nobody will get, but I, I that, that was my impression of John Gruden, who coached the Raiders back in the day. And actually, I guess he's the coach now, too. <laughs> Wow. He came out of retirement to coach the Raiders again. But yeah, that those are his uh, famous words from the... God, what was the name of that NFL documentary show? The, it was America's Game. America's, America's Game. Game. We used to watch it on Hulu. And they showed uh, they showed uh, Gruden coaching the Raiders, and he did exactly that. Get off your ass! You know, so I thought that was so funny, I had to incorporate it in this. Oh, man, that was fun. <laughs> hustle, hustle, hustle! All right, fake run and pass boot, Nigel Ready? Ready? English, Wario! Take the run to Mario, then I run into you deep. Ready? Derp. Ready. Let's do it. Derp. <laughs> Blue 19! Blue 19, hut! Thank you, Gus Babington, for your generous super chat. They said, any chance Doug or Julian will ever make it on a stream? It's possible, but probably yes. unlikely. Julian took a break from social media, and uh, Doug has been super busy Back with his personal life, so I doubt it. But you never know. All right, guys. We are playing like crap. Well, thank Whoever you for the super chat. the quarterback gets a raise. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. oh my lord. Didn't an NFL team get caught for something like that? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> that was going on back then, I guess. You said it, DK. And we're back. Mario Brothers, you kick off to join the second half. <laughs> All right. Roll right option on two. Ready? Break. Break. Oh, roll. Yellow 12. Yellow 12. This is another Water Wars song. You just need uh, Matt to be like, you lose. <laughs> DK says to run a fake play. You know, that's not a bad idea. Fake right option on two. Ready? Break. Scared to have his karate skills. He's like, not even the ninja. <laughs> <laughs> like Yoshi getting uh, walked off for an injury. Stop these guys, or I'll make you all feel very, 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 very bad about yourselves. That's what I thought. Tsubasi turning into the darkness or something. <laughs> Maybe Tsubasi was the darkness the whole time. Ha! I'm in the red zone. That's what you are. Suck. <laughs> uh, no, geez, I think that's an old reference. His mic drop moment, except it's the sunglasses. Oh, wow. <laughs> I forgot that we did that. 
little Anyone, star effect there. At least ninjas are still better than pirates. Oh, yeah. We got ninja yeah. one pirate. Oh, yeah. Ninja one pirate. Pirates. Pirates. We got another game to get to, guys. Let's go. <laughs> Where are they going? It guys, what was the point of that game? We didn't win or lose anything. Mario? Just to show how awesome we are at football. Oh, and to show that no one can remember John Dinsky's name. Subashi! And then Luigi had a midlife crisis. He became angry. <laughs> uh, so, wow, it's already noon. Uh, and we like are, halfway through. We're just halfway, and I thought that might be the case because we keep stopping and talking. But yeah. that's kind of the thing. So I think we can actually save the second half of Super Summer for a Super like Summer uh, Part 2. I like really that. Good. Yeah, no, that, that, that's a good place to end it because that football arc was a long one. And I agree, like to pause and give commentary you can't breeze through a 45 minute video in 45 minutes it's usually double so yeah <laughs> find out next time on the amazing ventures of rich and chris do commentary on their old content hooray right so we'll be back with part two of this either next weekend or the weekend after because next yeah. week we might be doing uh one on youtube news is um so yes. that'll be good <clears throat> so basically if matt's free next weekend it'll be youtube news if matt's busy we'll rich and i'll pick back up and do super summer part two but either way you'll get you'll continue to get more of these commentary live streams um anyway uh so i guess to wrap things up here we wanted to make a few announcements first off once this stream is done for those of you that don't know i had been streaming fall guys on my personal channel so if you guys want to stream raid me we're gonna hop over to my channel in a few minutes and i'm gonna play fall guys for an hour or two um so just wanted to mention that real quick so don't leave yet we're gonna keep going uh and then rich i think you wanted to talk about your new uh video that you just posted yesterday in the show idea you have right uh yes uh before all y'all leave uh please go and watch um movies retold badly i posted it yesterday so if you just click on you know my videos you'll see that it should be the most recent thing other than this i guess once this goes public but uh yeah that's a new series that i'd like to try out um uh, first one is me retelling the story of Joe Dirt, a movie that I have never seen. So the joke with this series is that uh, someone, and, and again, in this case, it's me, um, tells the story of a movie they've never seen. And they try to present it as if they have seen it. So, you know, they make up a, they improv completely on the spot, uh, a completely different story based on just what they've seen in the movie posters. So, you know, the Joe... I've, I've still never seen Joe Dirt. I'm going to watch it eventually. But, you know, Joe Dirt is David Spade, and he's holding a mop, and I, I assume he's like a janitor, and he goes on a crazy adventure. But that's all I know based on the movie poster and what friends have told me. So then, just going with that, I made up a story that is probably completely not Joe Dirt. So... That's kind of the that's kind of the uh, <laughs> the premise. So like you know, in weeks to come, we'll have uh, you know other friends you know retell movies that they've never seen. And I don't know. I thought it was a pretty good idea. So I hope you guys go click on that and check it out because it's a lot of fun. Uh, Chris is either going to do uh, Blade Runner or you know what, Chris, you had even mentioned to me on the phone that uh, you you asked me if I'd seen the Super Mario Brothers movie, and of course I have, but maybe you have it. So <laughs> I've seen so I've seen clips on YouTube, but I've never watched the full thing. So, <laughs> so I think it would be a fun one. <laughs> maybe maybe you retell the story of the of the Super Mario Brothers movie. And the and the hilarious thing is um, I th I think that whatever you tell, whatever you make up would be better than what was in the movie <laughs> because the movie is so off base. But I think Band that might be a good one. It. So we'll we'll decide we'll decide yeah. what Chris is gonna do, but um, it could be the Super Mario Brothers 1990, 1991, whatever year it came out, feature starring John Leguizamo as Luigi and um, Bob Hoskins as Mario. So that like that will be a good thing, hopefully, uh, to check out for. But go ahead and watch the first one with me from yesterday. It's a lot of fun. Please support that. It's it is just something I'm doing for fun. But you know, I always hope that you guys will watch it and check it out and share it with your friends. There you go. And speaking of sharing things with your friends, you should come hang out at the Rich Alvarez Discord. You should invite your friends too. That is where uh, me and Richie and Matt and Garrett and a few others all hang out as well as a ton of fans. So if you've been wondering, hey, where's the stupid Mario Bros fan community been hiding? That is where we are at. Um, so make sure that you hang out there if you want to stay in touch. Um, 
And then, as always, be sure to give this video a like if you haven't already, since that helps YouTube know that, uh, well, to be favorable toward our videos with their their algorithm that uh, who knows who knows how it works these days. Um, and then, like I mentioned, in a few minutes, uh, basically right after this finishes, we'll be jumping over to my channel for those of you that are still free, and I'm going to play some Fall Guys. For those of you that don't know, it is a Mario Party Battle Royale that is very, very fun. So I hope that if you are free, you'll come and join me there. I'll be starting a few minutes after we wrap up here. Uh, um, yes, I think we covered work. everything. Oh, yeah, put I... that in the... <laughs> Yeah, I just posted a link to the video that you guys absolutely must watch. And when I say you absolutely must watch it, I actually mean please click on it. I don't care if you've already seen it. Go watch it again. <laughs> this is Richie's uh, recent Joe Dirt movies retold badly. It is very clever. I think you guys will get a kick out of it. And it's okay if you haven't seen Joe Dirt because I haven't seen it either. <laughs> Neither is Richie. So uh, there you go. Um, yeah, there's not a whole okay. lot of movies I haven't seen. So I had to pick one I haven't seen. And it was between Joe Dirt and... And uh, I don't even know. <laughs> that was the only one that we could think of. So uh, that's uh, that's it. Uh, go check that out. And I hope to see you guys make a comment on that video and like that video, please. <laughs> Richie, would you like to send us off with a please subscribe voice? Oh, sure. <clears throat> Please subscribe! It's free and easy! Just like watching old Rich Alvarez video for nostalgia's sake and then getting bored going to sleep early and waking up cranky. <laughs> How's that? <laughs> yeah, I like it. It's our modern 2020 narrator subscribe voice. <laughs> or 2021, I should say. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching the stream. Special thanks to everybody who super chatted and special thanks to our members who are subscribed, like double, like how would we get, it's not double, subscribe. double subscribing. All right, so thank you guys and we'll check you out later. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> Takes a minute for the stream to actually end. <laughs> this stream needs to end now.